What's up guys, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm just gonna do a, an everyday, but a little bit more glam, you know what I mean? All right, um, I already have my eyebrows on, so I'm just gonna go ahead and prep my eyelids, and I just like to put little dots on my eyelids, because you don't really need that much, you know what I mean? And then I'm just gonna go ahead and do the same thing on the other eye. I'm gonna go ahead and use the J-Cats palette, and it is Sunset Boulevard. It has 24 eyeshadows. Um, I recommend it, it is actually really good. Um, it's just hard to open, you know what I mean? All right, so first shade I'm gonna go in is with this one, and this is the SB2 from the Sunset Boulevard palette. Look, you see how pigmented it is? I literally just tapped it in. Now I'm just gonna go ahead and do the same thing to the other eye. So, all right, so now that I have got um, that in my creases and over the creases, I forgot what it's called, but let's just ignore that. Next, what I'm gonna do is also add that color to my eyelids and then I'll make a little half cut crease. All right, so I'm gonna go back in with the shade SB2 right over here and then just put that all over my eyelid. All right, and I'm gonna do the same thing that I did here to the other eye, and I'll be right back. All right, so next, um, I'm just gonna show you guys how I, I made this cut crease. I've never actually done a half crease, so if it's not good, just ignore it. You know, we all learners here. So now we're just gonna go ahead and do the same thing I did with this eye to the other. You already know the meal. All right, so now I have done that, I'm just gonna add like a little shimmer or something into it. Mm. All right, so now I'm gonna go with SB15, which is this one right here. And I'm just gonna go ahead and put that over that cut crease. Just to give it like a little pop or something. And now I'm just gonna go ahead and do the same thing to the other eye. So now that I have done that, if I notice I did go a little bit too overpassed or like the shimmer's looking a little bit too much, I'll go back in with um, shade SB2 right at the top. And then I'll go above the crease just to outline, outline the crease so it stands out a little bit more. All right, so now I'm just gonna go ahead and do the eyeliner. And for eyeliner, I'm gonna use the Essence Waterproof Eyeliner Pen. And I might have to cut this out because I do struggle putting my eyeliner on and recording because I feel like I put the mirror right in front of my face and you guys can't see. Now that I've finished my eyeliner, I know I look a little funky because I don't usually do this. I usually do a wing eyeliner, but let's just get away from the wing eyeliner for a bit. Usually once I do eyeshadow and everything, I'd like to go back in and clean it with my concealer, just the slightest bit, just so it can look a little bit cleaner. I'm just gonna put my eyelashes on and for eyelashes today I'm gonna be using these these are kind of cute I just bought these this is my first time actually trying these lashes out I've tried other brands I've never actually really used these these aren't fluffy as I mean they're a little bit wispy but they're not fluffy fluffy but I'm gonna go ahead and put this on my eye before it completely dries I'm just gonna go ahead and do the rest of my face. For concealer, I'm gonna go ahead and use my Maybelline New York concealer in shade sand. Alright, and for foundation today, I'm gonna be using the Fenty Beauty Pro Filter Soft Matte Longwear Foundation. That was a lot to read, but oh well. And then of course, I'm gonna go in with the Beauty Blender. Alright, so now that I have bronzed up and everything, I'm going to go ahead and use 
some of the highlight and I'm gonna use the Too Faced. Yeah, as you can see, a lot of the stuff I have just fades away. Okay, and now I'm just gonna bronzer up a bit. And then for bronzer, I'm actually gonna use this powder foundation from Mali. It is medium tan. I'm gonna use this because I don't wanna go a little bit too dark on um, bronzer. And for blush, I'm gonna be using this one right here. This is pink blush, it's from Ulta. All right, and for lipstick, I'm actually thinking about just using a lip pen, a lip, lip pencil, and this is also from Ulta, and it is in shade Spice. I'm not really liking this color for this look, so I'm just gonna put a little bit of setting powder over it and maybe I'll lighten it up and maybe I'll like the color. Now it's a little bit lighter. Kind of liking it a little bit more. Oh, I'm just gonna, oh wait, I almost forgot mascara. Mascara for my under lashes. Gotta love that. All right, and this is the finishing look. But I hope you guys enjoyed. Please give this video a like, and if you aren't subscribed yet, please subscribe to my channel. And also, turn on your post notifications because you never know what what video can be up on this. And watch out, don't get in no beef with me because you might be up on this page. But thanks again for watching. I'll see you next video. Peace.